Hello everyone, Mr. Bean 35000 vr here, and today I'm bringing you a video about a brand new update that has just been released for CTGP that adds 200cc to Mario Kart Wii. Bandy's time was 5 hours, 59 minutes, 4 seconds on the legendary Desert Bus track. Today we're going to try to beat it. He is in the chat, he has joined us. This is going to make history. Bandy's either going to be the record holder of the longest Mario Kart track, or we're gonna take his title. Yeah, I told you. I freaking told you. <laughs> Bandy, nothing happened. That's we that's found out together. I have it somewhere. The air is just lying around. I wonder what the forecast is. Everyone cling on, I'm going to make the world spin. We, go get the news. <laughs> We, it'll be a while. We, we, <laughs> grinning, cat face with smiling eyes. The end. Transcript by Wumi Luma. Oh, no, Wumi, come on. No, no, I'm a tree! I am a tree! Fuck, I'm a tree! Well, I'm a tree! I don't want to be a tree! Hey everyone, this is Miro here. Have you ever wondered what it would be like if you took Mario Kart Wii and you just kind of stretched it? The start, Luigi circuit. Didn't it look great? <laughs> so guys, basically there's this track that's claiming to be harder than Mushroom Peaks. And uh, I've had a look at it and it looks really, really bad. Okay, so right off the bat, you can just already tell this is going to be horrible. What's up guys, PK Sparks here, and welcome back to a highly requested and long awaited return. I'm calling it now. I'm hashtag Mario Kart Monday. Hey all, Scott here. There I was, about to get out of bed and face the challenges life had for me that day. But then the trauma came back and and I just couldn't do it with this in the room. Hello everyone, Mr. Bean 35000 vr here, and yes indeed I have managed to get 24 races loaded once in Mario Kart Wii. Guys, don't settle. That's another thing, man. Don't fucking settle. Make sure that whatever life that you want, you strive for that shit. You make sure you go for that shit. Don't let anyone tell you it's not possible. Don't let anyone tell you that it's not practical. You make sure that you go for it. You hungry? You want it? Then get it! Get that shit! Don't let nobody stop you. I went to a homeless shelter to get what I have now. I went to a homeless shelter. I struggled. I went hungry three nights in a row every week to get what I have. You don't let no one stop you, nigga. No one tell you what the fuck to do. You make sure you get it. Don't let no one stop you, alright? You're driven. You the, 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 the energy that you need, the drive you need to get it, you pull that from yourself. Because when you pull it from yourself, no one can influence it. Just you. I'm here. I'm here, nigga. I'm here, nigga. I'm here, nigga. I came from the gutter. I know what the gutter feels like. I know what it tastes like, nigga. I lived in my bitch's closet at one point. I lived in Christine's closet. But did, did that stop me? No. You know how many people would wish they could live in her closet? How many refugees, how many people disenfranchised by the countries wish they could be in that position? Oh damn, my fucking brother got his head blown off yesterday. I don't know if I'm gonna have a meal tomorrow. Those are the people that wish they could be in the positions that you and I call hard positions. We don't suffer. We don't face struggle. We don't face hardship. We don't face difficulty. We are living in a first world country. We don't know struggle. If you have internet right now, you don't know struggle. You know who knows struggles? The people that are dying out there. They know struggle. They're the ones that are suffering. They're the ones that have true hardships. So how can you call your own problems difficult? You rise! You rise! You beat those problems! You don't let nothing stop you, nigga! You take over everything! 